top for our camping list on a map in the biblic building. Cold man. All right, let's pick people up. All right. So, just a disclaimer, as always. Uh, if you play Call of Duty with me, if I yell at you, it's not because I'm mad at you or anything like. Yo, that. you invite me? Yeah, I invited you. Um, it's not because I'm mad at you. Oh, yeah, I invited you. Uh, remember, it's not because I'm mad at you or anything like that. I'm just very competitive. Um, I might not play very well tonight because, like, my air conditioner is currently out. So there is no central air in my home at all. And it's probably going to be this way for about three or four days. So, as it sits right now... As the night goes on, it's going to get colder and colder and colder. <laughs> so. It is what it is. Yeah, I think the electric motor in the... I, I, I think what's wrong with my AC unit is the electric motor in my air handler has failed. And it needs an evaporator coil cleaning. But... Here, here's the lowdown with my AC unit. It's 22, possibly 23 years old at this point. Um, the evaporator coal is very rusted. It costs $688.78 to get a replacement evaporator coil, plus shipping and handling and taxes. So you're looking at $750 for a new evaporator coil. Um, you have to drain the system. You have to drain the freon out of the system and put it back into the system to change the evaporator coil. You're looking at another five or six hundred dollars there, right? The electric motor is going to run me another hundred and fifty to two hundred dollars with labor. I didn't have any factored in labor with the other thing. So, and even if I do all that, I still have a compressor that has a, a pressure valve regulator switch that we have bypassed outside, that's also 23 years old, and that thing cost $1,000 as well. So with all this adds up, I think it's best just to consider it dead at this point and just go ahead and change out the AC unit because I could put all this money into it and still have a 23-year-old unit, it. or I could take all that money and bundle it towards a new unit. My brother is an AC tech, though, but he but he works for a company, and even though I'm pretty good, uh, I'm you know in the good in the good graces of his boss, like like he took us to see Mortal Kombat and stuff like that, I still got to pay my fair way, so I can't like get zero labor, right? My brother, you know, doesn't do me as side work; he does me as his thing. Okay. Like I've already I've already priced the unit. The unit's going to be three thousand six hundred and eighty dollars. You're looking at another 500 or so dollars for a heat pump. Um, so, and then I want a digital thermometer that I can connect to the internet. So that's gonna be another $300. So like I'm looking at $4,300 for the unit. I figured I'm gonna pay another thousand to $1,400 for labor. So I'm figuring it's going to be $5,800, $6,000 for a new unit plus interest because I might have to get it on a payment plan. I was kind of hoping that my AC unit would last until Dr. Grayson got paid off, which I would like another $200 on Dr. Grayson's bill. Life's not fair and the world is mean. <laughs> Whoa, wow. You guys realize that you can shoot that down with five bullets, right? I'm just saying, like it's been up the whole time. Like it can be shot down with your yeah. gun. I haven't done it because I have a burst weapon. So it cost me like 20 bullets to do it. What? All right, if you go in negative, please stop moving. We're a five stat. <laughs> we should not be losing. Could be upstairs. All right, control the house. Yeah, we got the house right now. No, we don't. There's a guy still up the stairs. Come on. Start camping. We're about to lose here. Go, 
boys. We lost the house again. Come on, boys. Like, what are you doing? Everybody's doing their own fucking thing. Big Snacks spent 20 minutes going over your money problems, critiquing your fans' mic quality and critiquing your team. That talks why people hate him. All I said was somebody had a shit mic, and everybody on my team agreed he had a shit mic. It was pointless. They're waiting for me at this point. Let's try and protect his KD. Yeah, I'm going to slow down my uh, gameplay a little bit. You guys should have been slower. Like, remember when we're yeah. when we're, we're planting, like you do because he's pushed. You ain't got to push into their spawn here. Remember, over the middle, there's going to be snipers. Over sign of balcony, there's going to be snipers. It's, it's very difficult to beat snipers. We lose a person to a sniper every fucking round. Nobody went A. You guys are dying too fucking quick, dude. Give me time to pick people. Please, stop dying within the first 30 seconds. I'm pushing with you, Wings. I'm going back to their spawn. No! Sniper to your left. Ah, he's sniping up. Two, 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 two. Dude. One in spawn, a sniper. Kale, Ken, Ken, take that fucking weapon off, dude. Take it off. Put a real weapon in your hand. Stop with this sniper bullshit. That's the reason you guys are fucking... Not Push winning. Them. Winning is not camping with claymores. Uh, dog, I'm doing better than most of your team. That's called hiding. Like a bitch. Yeah, look at you, buddy. You're sitting in the back of the fucking mess. Shut your You're literally up. standing you in your spawn. Kill. That's not. They're pop stopping. And literally, they're criticizing me when I was on a. They killed me on a flank there. It's called buying time, letting them sit out, making them get uncomfortable. You can't do this game. shit too Anybody serious. can go Touch 17. I, I can't the entire game, but I had a plant. Okay. Hey, Daryl Scott, have you seen the old PK boot camp video where you're swinging a baseball bat? Ain't no way you play baseball because that swing is dead broke, homie. Dude, I was fine with baseball. Yeah. Because because you're looking at my swing when I'm almost in my 30s, it's fucking so 400 pounds. He's not at all. Get some fucking Spanish rice and a burrito on top of that motherfucker. Follow me. Linda. Damn, son, he went behind me. Ah, oh, two guys coming my way. Banana, why are you using a sniper rifle in A? Dude, man's using a bolt action rifle in a close range engagement. Come on, boys. Why are we planting the bomb? We have the bomb, but we're going going for gunfights. Come on. Lead the bomb to me. Give me the bomb. Get fuck. I'm playing that on A. Uh, it's because our teammates aren't winning their gunfights. All right, my team. If you get caught with a sniper rifle in your hand, I'm removing you from the team. Damn. Like, seriously, stop playing with dumbass weapons. Hey, I'm about to just kill myself. All right. First off, why the fuck do we have anybody go to B? Which flag was pushed every fucking round? A. Correct. So Ken, why were you at B when when I when I died just now? I just felt like somebody was gonna push her from up from that side. Yeah, we're sorry, man. We're so sorry. We'll do better next time. It's ridiculous, man. Yo, can I? I got a friend. No. You need an extra man. No. No. Okay. Like I said, I want to win. I want to win every fucking round of every search. I don't want to lose a round. So, like, people, like, wandering around and, like, playing close quarters engagements with a sniper rifle and shit like that, to me, that's them not taking the game serious. That didn't work, did it? Double team each. <laughs> oh, sniper rifle. I wish I could mute Bud Muncher. Why? You're annoying. One by the truck that over there. Dude, they need to bring Juggernaut back in this fucking game. Yeah, Juggernaut is a kill streak, but they need to like, if nothing else, put the armored plates back in. You know, remember the plates that you could slide into your thing on a, like a that would make you so you could survive a sniper shot on top. Oh, he sniped me. He might be cheating. He might be cheating. Yeah, this guy's cheating. That's why he's such a good sniper. He's just fucking cheating. Dude, he was wall banging him through the floor without a UAV up. 
by the way, I ban for people who be facetious in my chat. Uh, Rush B, no stop. He's using wall hacks for, at, at the very least. This guy is. That uh, that pure X guy is using wall hacks. All right, ban Ryan, please, for being an idiot. Uh, ban Rush B nonstop as well. Don't 30 second timeout. Ban him permanently. Freaking hacker, dude. You guys suck. Yeah, that pure X guy is 100% a wall hacker. Yeah, bro, he, 100% a wall hacker. He he was wall banging people through the floor. I heard your footsteps, dumbass. You didn't hear no footsteps, and you're not gonna hit a guy twice through the fucking floor with a sniper rifle. You're just a cheater. You cannot convince me he was not at least wall hacking. He might not have aimbotted, but he was at least wall hacking. He's at least wall hacking.